Hey there, football manager fans, how you doing? Um, I've decided to do something different today. Uh, I've decided to do Rochdale Day. Um, so we're playing Sunderland away today. And I'm just kind of thinking that maybe um, I could do five or six Rochdale games in a row and try to get a bit of consistency because I seem to be flitting from one team to the other and forgetting what I'm doing and uh, some teams I'm playing 4-2-4 others I'm playing 4-2-3-1 and uh, forgetting which is my best team so we're going to be putting out Lillis, McLaughlin, Banks, Landell, Williams and Hill at the back Camps and Rathbone in midfield Henderson, Clough, Musa behind Best uh, yeah <laughs> So, what I'll do is I'll do five Rochdale games or six Rochdale games today, put them out. Then I'll do um, the same with Rangers tomorrow. Then I'll do the same with Man United. And then we'll catch up with the Journeyman and do the same with the Journeyman. Because the Journeyman has like 120 days or something winter break. Um, <laughs> which is absolutely mental. And, uh, yeah, it's basically I'm, I'm spending what seems to be an hour and a half to two hours just clicking um, processing button um, to get to maybe three week down the line <laughs> uh, four week down the line it's terrific um, I didn't realize there was such a long winter break and obviously there is because you know in Denmark they do have a bit of snow so <laughs> <laughs> they they obviously need a winter break, um, but yeah, they've got like four months of it, and um, yeah, it's it's quite a lot. So we're fifteen, uh, sorry, sift, sorry, we're fifteen points. Playing Sunderland, who are second with seventeen points. Um, you know, Charlton seem to be running away with the league at the moment, as was predicted at the start of the season, along with Barnsley and Portsmouth, Bradford. Uh, uh, there as well um, Oviedo puts that one over the bar for them so we're playing at a stadium of light today and uh, yeah we're, we're doing doing bits here's Musa Henderson oof nearly yeah we're doing bits in the league we're, we're alright um, moved up to 5th Bradford seem to be losing to someone uh, Barnsley are losing 1-0 to Burton um, so we could we could gain a few places here. Um, I think it's going to be a tough tough old season. Um, we're only eight games into it, nine games in. Um, I think this might be our ninth uh, game today. So it's going to be a tough old a tough old slog. Um, they have Aidan McGeady playing for them, <laughs> with George Honeyman and Lyndon Gooch playing behind Sam Gallagher, who's on loan from Southampton. They have uh, his camps now to Henderson. Honeyman for them. Well, they're going to counter us with Sam Gallagher. Stop backing off. Go on, Ethan. Ooh. There's Gooch. Talk to me, Gooch. <laughs> Max Power. It's Oviedo. Costa Rican International. Max Power. Good save by Lillis. Um, <laughs> it's worth signing Lyndon Gooch just to say, talk to me, Gooch. Um, <laughs> quite a good player actually as well um, <laughs> Camps, Musa oh, his shot, shot is blocked McLaughlin gives it back to Camps yeah, he's a 22 year old American uh, they got international players on their side they got Brian Oviedo is Costa Rican international um, Adam Matthews a Welsh international uh, I think John McLaughlin the goalkeeper even played for Scotland I think uh, don't think he currently does but used to Camps with the header out. Here's Max Power. It's a Lee Caramel. Can't find McGeady because McLaughlin sends it downfield to best. Oh, he's beat the defender. Oh, two men over. Musa. Oh, Musa. Get in. 1 0. Surprise goal by us. Absolutely blasted them on the counter attack there down the right hand side. McLaughlin from our 18 yard bots. 
long hoof ball forwards are best. He puts it in, there's Musa. Just controls with the left, finishes with the right. That's a great, great counter attack. And we move above Sunderland. <laughs> oh, if only this was real life. There we are, in between Charlton, Barnsley, Sunderland and Portsmouth. Oh God, please make that real life one time. Here's Camps. Let's hit the wall. Musa to Zach Clough, who's not injured in this game. <laughs> he banks Landell. Oh, the ball comes off him for a goal kick. Yeah, if Zach Clough could get injury free, we'd have had a decent player last year, but he just couldn't stay injury free. Um, a shame, really. They're not playing well at all, um, look at them, 6.4s, 6.5s. Um, here's Camps, to Clough, Henderson, Rathbone shoots, McLaughlin saves. And we're near half time now, we'll have this corner come in from Hill. Who, oh, Baldwin gets it out, up to the halfway line, and that should be the half time whistle. And we go into it, 1-0. 1-0 up and, and deservedly so, 61% possession, 9 shots, 4 on target and uh, you've done well boys, get out there do it again, just need 45 minutes more of that boys, come on, uh, Leon Best by the way, what a free signing and his agent wanted him to come on trial with us so we took him, here he is now, let's off for Musa gives it to Hill, gives it back to Musa who comes inside, no other option, here's Henderson, back to Musa who's tackled by Max Power, Catamore gets it clear, here's the eel. Ethan he banks Landell, here's McLaughlin, Hendo, Hendo puts it in, Dunn gets it out, Clough, oh, shots blocked, there's Rathbone, Hill, oh can't get a cross in, and uh, Nothing comes of that. Here's Camps to Ryan. Ryan puts it in. Oh, it's hit the post. What the hell? Was that Leon Best? Don't know what their keeper was doing there. He spazzed out for a moment there, didn't he? Here's Best. Oh, he's at the post again. Oh, it's going to cross the goal. Oh, Matthews hooks it away. Oh, no. Oh, that could have been a second goal, that. Dear me. Um, they're having a bad day today, them lot, aren't they? Rathbone's been booked. Don't make a change just for making a sake. Uh, change, uh, change Pepe, just for the sake of it. There's Musa. Oh, own goal, Adam Matthews. Oh no. Oh, it's been disallowed. Pushing another player. Is that Leon Best? Yellow card. Oh, thought we had a second goal there. There's Gooch for them. Get it out. Tackle him, come on. There's McGeady. It's a Baldwin to Catamol. Oof, I was about to say, I don't mind if he shoots because he's not good at shooting. And I thought he put it in. <laughs> Hill to Musa. Musa Musa. Josh Lewis. Eel, Ryan, Best, Musa, Hendo, put it in Hendo, Ryan will put it in, back post, can't get hold of it, Matthews got it, Rathbone to Musa, Best, shoots, 2-0, oh what a goal, fifth goal of the season for Leon Best, assisted by Frank Musa, that's his fifth goal in nine games, not bad at all, Um better than Calvin Andrew and Aaron Wilbraham at the moment <laughs> uh, I think he's already scored what they would score for a season and it's only been nine games so here's Max Power Baldwin bangs it forward Ryan gets there McLaughlin running across the field for some reason um, looks for Musa but can't find him Best tries to close people down but can't do it Matthews comes forward and I think Ollie was after him there. He's Gallagher for them. Lily saves. That was a dodgy save. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Right. Okay, let's um let's 
bring Hamilton on for Ollie Rathbone. Um, and let's uh, let's just leave it at that for the moment. So Leon Best is booked. I'm conscious of that. But um, yeah, let's let's keep it the way it is for the moment. Um, we're in fourth position. It's not bad. I'm pretty sure Bradford would be uh, happy to be in third right there, considering they got relegated. Oh, they're not in third anymore. Uh, <laughs> poor Bradford. Um, let's see, they're making changes, aren't they? Hendo's got booked. Best has been booked. So. Let's bring on Prahuli for Hendo and let's bring on Akprat Pro for Best. Let's see how that works. Um. Great, now Musa gets booked. <laughs> Pro wants to play as pressing forward. Fine, you do that, mate. And Prue really wants to play there. Okay, you do that. Um, yep, yeah, they're happy where they're playing, so that's 2 0 for us. Um, I think what we'll do is we'll tell the boys to start tightening, tightening things up now because 2 0 against Sunderland. Um, that's actually a really good, really good result. There's Oviedo for them, Morgan the substitute, finds Gallagher and Maguire to power, but saved by Lillis. It's a free kick for some reason. Um, here's Hill for us, Musa to Camps. Oh god, he went in on Musa there, come on ref. There's Camps. Disgraceful ref. You book best for nothing and don't give anything for Musa. You dog. You absolute dog referee. And oh, it's at the post. Ah, oh, Musa gets it in. That corner in it, the crossbar then. And I don't really know what happened. <laughs> Hill puts it in. I think. Camps heads it across uh, against the crossbar and it rebounds out and Musa's just Johnny on the spot there and uh, that was good good for him I think it was uh, Callum Camps because uh, he's the only ginger in the team there really yeah um we tightened up boys stay tightened up 3-0 let's keep a good goal difference here got Bradford has scored again so they've got an extra point on us there's Morgan the Catamull he plays it back to Oviedo Oviedo punts it forward Hamilton's there Catamull retrieves it gives it to Oviedo hits it long again to Flanagan Ooh, Maguire just missed that I thought it scored then. Um, and there's the full time whistle. Rochdale 3, Sunderland 0. Have a word. Get in. Um, we'll forgive Ollie. 6.7. We'll forgive him. He, he plays well enough most of the time. Here's Frank Moosa. 9.3. Two goals. Mr. Johnny on the spot. Mr. Worldwide. And <laughs> 18 shots. Uh, 8 on target. 55% of possession. Yeah, we deserved that. Lyndon Gooch was their best player with 6.7. Oviedo 6.1. They were just bang average today, Sunderland, for some reason. Um, I've no idea. <laughs> no idea why. Uh, but hey ho, not my problem. Uh, we won. <laughs> so, Sunderland's still staying second today. No? No, they dropped down. Uh, to sixth where we were and we go fourth 
so we're four points four points behind Charlton um, but more importantly we are 12 points above relegation yay tell I'm a proper Rochdale fan can't you I'm, look, I'm looking down here everyone else is looking up here and I'm cynical me cynical Dale fan looking down here going with 12 points clear of that that's good that's mighty good that is not even thinking oh we're 4 points off top you know <laughs> absolute nightmare honestly uh, let's have a look at Curtis Tilt he's a good good player for Blackpool um, yeah quite decent good on the ball um, somewhere I think we should be looking at uh, in real life and send the assistant we send him when we lose so we might as well send him when we win <laughs> right, you're brilliant well done Musa 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 you star man so that's the first game today uh, Rochdale against Sunderland hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one take care